Now, Clearwater police investigating a homicide that they say appears to be a case of self-defense. A woman said she was attacked as she woke up and fatally shot the intruder, who we just learned was her neighbor. News Channel 8's Chip Osowski joins us now live from the Clearwater Police Department, where the chief briefed reporters a short time ago. Chip. Good afternoon to you both. Yeah, Chief Daniel Slaughter held a news conference here at the Clearwater Police Headquarters just a little while ago. He identified the attacker as 26-year-old Justin William Wright. He says Wright broke into the victim's, victim's home, rather, and that's when the victim called 911. She was able to reach out and call 911 during this attack, but the attack persisted, at which time she was able to retrieve a gun that she had lawfully purchased and she used that gun to defend herself. Clearwater Police Chief Daniel Slaughter tells Aid on Your Side officers responded to the home at 1639 Flagler Drive shortly before 9 this morning. It appears audio of the attack may have been captured on the 911 call. I've not listened to the tape yet for the point where they initially received it at Region 911, but yes, much of this would have been captured on a 911 tape, it sounds like. Police identified the attacker as 26-year-old Justin William Wright, a man who lived next door to the victim. At this point, investigators are trying to sort out the motive. They have not said the attack was sexual in nature. We're going to avoid talking about too many of the details, so that I can tell you that she was, she was asleep in the residence. Okay, she was attacked. Uh, she does have injuries that are consistent with that attack. And, uh, you know, uh, I think your point's well taken about the question of whether or not it was sexual in nature, but at this point, that's enough. It's dang, it was scary. Chief Slaughter tells us it appears this was a case of self-defense, but the investigation is ongoing and is not over. You certainly don't just say, yeah, chalk it up to self-defense and move on. There's an awful lot of work that will occur. The, the crime scene is going to be investigated just as any other death or murder or homicide or, you know, even in this particular case, potentially a justified homicide. Yeah, so still very early in the investigation, authorities are still working to figure out if there was any history between the victim and her neighbor. I have also requested calls for service from both addresses. Reporting live in Clearwater, I'm Chip Osowski, 8 on your side.